What's up everyone? Welcome back to Cards by Chris. I'm Chris. Today's card opening video, we have Once Upon a Time in Queens, Part 3. So far, the first two packs have been pretty cool. Part 1 was pretty much putting the team together, all based on the documentary on ESPN. Part 2 was mostly about the beginning of the 1986 season. We were able to get this out of 86 refractor of Roger McDowell. Part three, I'm sure, will be the bulk of the season. Part four, probably the playoffs of the World Series. Guys, don't forget to subscribe. Crush that like button. We have so much great stuff coming up on Cards by Chris. We have Topps Heritage Minor League. We got Topps Pro Debut. If you like minor league cards, we got more Chrome. We got Archives on its way. The only thing we don't have, I really didn't invest in update this year. I didn't really love the checklist, so save my money for other stuff. So let's get ripping. Let's see what part three has in store. I'd love to get more uh, refractors. Maybe one of the auto cards. Let's see what we got. All right. Oh, Tyson. Heavyweight goes toe-to-toe -to, -toe to the best. I actually have this picture autographed by all three of them, which is really cool. One of my favorite pieces of memorabilia. Mike Tyson came to camp. Keith Hernandez takes time for a crossword puzzle. Let's Go Mets video. One of my favorite music videos from the 86 Mets. Strawberry Swings for the Fences. Shea Stadium, the division clincher. I remember this. I was a freshman in high school. Friends in my class had pieces of the turf growing in their backyard after that. NLCS Game 2, Keith Hernandez propels the Mets offense. Lenny Dykstra walk off in game three of the NLCS. Game five, Nolan Ryan versus Dwight Gooden. How about that? With a Mets, uh, Gary Carter walked it off in the 12th inning. And NLCS game six, the Mets win the pennant. Pretty cool. Recollection of those days in the 86. If you watch Once Upon a Time in Queens, you see this follows along with it. We didn't get any refractors in this. I'm a little disappointed. Or autos. Hopefully we get one in part four. Maybe a Jesse Orozco. That would be pretty cool. Guys, thanks a lot for tuning in. We'll do the next video tomorrow night. And then we'll start busting into some of this other stuff. So we'll see you on the next video.